First of all, it, it uh, takes a lot of time to cope with all the regulatory requirements. Uh, there are all kinds of uh, requests and surveys made, and now we face the funny situation that uh, we have here in Germany, but this goes also for other markets in, the U in, the, in Europe, that we have local uh, banking supervisor authorities like the BaFin, Banque de France and everything, and at the same time the European banking authority, the EBA, is preparing its weapons, let's say, and uh, so uh, everybody tries to prove relevance and to uh, be more scrutinizing than the other, and uh, so it's a quite uh, uh, lively time at the moment. But uh, otherwise, uh, the, the increase in capital requirements, we, the banks have a time for, for many years actually to cope with it. Uh, many want to do, of course, of, as soon as possible. But uh, this will, will be, be dominating or, or stipulating the landscape for the next years, I would say. So growth, growth perspectives are limited for, for most banks. Uh, and uh, um, the banking, as I said, I mean, in Europe, uh, compared to the US, banks have always been lower capitalized. I he hesitate to say undercapitalized. But uh, this is something together with increasing capital requirements and, and then historically low capital underlying, which means you had a, a, a small buffer to cope with, with uh, any setback. And uh, uh, this together will be difficult to overcome. But liquidity for, for, for financing, I mean, this financing gap has been talked about well, some years now. Um, uh, Morton pointed this out in, in Scandinavia or the Nordic markets, in Germany and uh, also some other European markets where the economy, the underlying economy is, say, in a better shape, broadly speaking. Um, the financing is available also for, say, secondary uh, markets. Um, it's, it's uh, what we dis tend to forget about uh, the discuss disc in the discussion about uh, lending and financing gap is that uh, it's, it's uh, principally, the, first of all, the economy that should be get more, getting more healthy. And if that occurs, also the banks can restart lending on corporate levels, on, on real estate, uh, and, and everything else. And so there's a sort of synergy between all these uh, sectors. Um, financing shouldn't be regarded as an isolated uh, science and uh, technique uh, where, where you just have to find the right trick and, and, and then it works. So un unfortunately, it will not be easy and it will take some more years, let's say, to get back to wherever, not where we were, I hope, but uh, to, a, to a more healthy state and uh, have some, some competition. I fully support this because competition means you keep in a good shape, you keep... Uh, <laughs> lean and fit and uh, don't, don't get slow. And that is actually something that you can draw on when times get a little bit more difficult.